I mean, I think my main goals when I started the fellowship was just to try as many different things as possible. I think coming into this, I really wanted to A, understand the solar landscape and industry and B, look for, you know, ways to apply myself. And I wanted to get integrated with the energy ecosystem, specifically clean energy ecosystem, because this was focus of my PhD and my postdoctoral work. I was able to bring all my expertise, uh, the technical expertise for my PhD, but also the soft skills uh, that you learn while when you're in academia uh, to, to the job. One of the good things about how the solar office and how they leverage the fellowship program is, you know, really kind of leaving it to the fellow to play to their strength and kind of flex in the ways that kind of align with the fellow's interests. My first week I was working on the supply chain report. And so that was, you know, a big thing for me to actually get my hands on something that felt really important. I guess I wasn't expecting to have quite so much fun or get so much of um, immediate access or opportunity to do things in the office. No two weeks are the same. This is what was attractive uh, to me, that uh, we on on week one, we were drafting uh, funding opportunity announcements. So in, w during week two, I would review reports by the National Renewable Energy Lab. Every day is different in the solar office and uh, there's a lot going on and there's a lot of opportunities to be involved in different aspects of the policy environment. Well, there's a lot of freedom and openness to explore new new topics, learn a lot, while also getting on the job training, developing professionally, developing skill sets that you may not get um, working in a lab in a, in a grad school setting. It would give you a very unique view of the solar industry or the solar academic community and it's going to be a great opportunity for you to pivot outside academia and to build uh, the next steps of your career and i couldn't think of a better place to kind of learn about the industry to learn about solar wherever you find yourself i think you can find something of value within the fellowship